when you think about cool Pokemon, who comes to mind? Some say Pikachu, while others would side of Charizard, or maybe you're a fan of Gyarados. Most of the 720 Pokemon from the series have at least a small fan base. Although, one of these creatures is almost universally hated. That's right, I'm talking about Klefki, the keychain Pokemon. Klefki has been accused of being unoriginal, weak, and useless. I myself actually love Klefki. In fact, he's my favorite Pokemon. After playing and beating a lot of Pokemon games, I have amassed proof that Klefki is actually quite cool. I intend to prove Klefki's worth because he is a character who has been given so much unneeded discredit. It's hard not to feel bad for him. Despite his general hatred in the Pokemon world, Klefki is actually it stronger, more useful, and more original than most people actually know. Now it's time to address the elephant in the room. Klefki is a keychain Pokemon. Game Freak, the company behind Pokemon, has been accused of running out of ideas many times, but Klefki's announcement was when even the most dedicated Pokemon fans began to lose faith in future Pokemon. After intense research, I had discovered that Klefki isn't nearly as unoriginal as people make him out to be. Klefki was an intentional character, meant to pr promote the new fairy-type Pokemon introduced in the game where, in, uh, where he made his first appearance, Pokemon Y. The key ring is based on pagan folklore. Pagan traditions include blaming the loss of a small possession such as sues or keys on mysterious fairies. From Game Freak's standpoint, Klefki is pretty original inspired Pokemon. It turns out that most people just don't understand their reasoning, so this disproves claims of Klefki's unoriginality. Originality is important, but the most crucial thing in the Pokemon world is who has the most powerful Pokemon. Most Pokemon fans assume that since, in their opinion, Klefki looks stupid, he must be weak and pathetic. Uh, surprisingly, he's one of the best Pokemon to have in a competitive match. Each Pokemon has a special ability that may greatly affect the battle. Klefki's ability is Prankster, which is based on his mischievous origin. Prankster causes all status moves to go before an opponent's move. This is great because you can use status moves like those that create a seal before your opponent can attack. With this skill, you can poison, freeze, confuse, or burn your opponent before they can even land a hit on you. You could even set, uh, put them asleep, which would leave them wide open before they can even strike you once. This gives Klefki a huge advantage over other Pokemon. He also learns many powerful moves, such as Giga Impact, Substitute, and Hyper Beam. Klefki's other ability, Magician, allows you to steal your opponent's item. This is extremely valuable against Pokemon with powerful items, such as Mega Stones or Leftovers. Klefki is actually used quite often in competitive matches. In conclusion, Klefki is a lot stronger than most people actually think. That, that's just his abilities and moves. There's so much more to Klefki's power. Pokemon can have one to two types out of a total of 18 unique types. Klefki has a unique type combination of Fairy and Steel types. This makes him weak to only Ground and Fire types. He's completely immune to Dragon Poison types. This is that's amazing things to be immune to because dragons uh, is arguably the strongest Pokemon type, and poison types can, as the name implies, poison you. Uh, Klefki is resistant to most other types, which makes him a well-rounded fighter. There's one last complaint that many people have against this Pokemon. People say that Klefki is utterly useless in real life. Keychains already exist, so why would we need a living keychain uh, to help us? The answer lies in Klefki's Pokédex entry. For those who don't know, the Pokédex is a database that gives you information on all Pokémon. In Pokémon Y and Pokémon Alpha Sapphire, Klefki's Pokédex entry states, It never lets go of a key it likes, so people give it keys to vaults and safes as a way to prevent crime. This makes Klefki the ultimate security device. You can't steal someone's Pokémon without a lot of tough work, and if your keys are stored on your Pokémon, they're pretty much unstealable. This makes Klefki a much more useful Pokemon than, say, Trubbish or Vanellus. In conclusion, despite many people's opinions on Klefki's importance, he has many desirable traits that make him amazing. Klefki is original, very useful, and an all-around great Pokemon. It's unfortunate this amazing Pokemon gets such a bad rap and gets nowhere near the credit it deserves. The fact that Klefki goes through all of this and still fights earn my, earns my deepest respect. No matter what anybody says... Klefki is cool. Thanks for watching.